the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than five years apart, and they have the same height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Hollywood, California, the Destroyer. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting at a Limasso Cypress Hercules. All right, Griffin, you're losing the locker room. I want you to be my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. Like this has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. And with that, we are underway from the United Center here in the Windy City, Chicago, Illinois. position here. He's posturing up here. He's got the arm trapped of his opponent. Good defense. Now, now he's in on top of half guard. Nice hammer fist. Oh, and reversed. Just over three minutes to go. And he gets reversed. A little bit uneventful. Tries to pass here, but gets shut down. Nice sweep. Finds a home for the left hand there. Beautiful reversal. Tries to pass, but cannot. a big shot from the bottom. He lands a huge elbow to the head. 
excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Reversal and into full guard. Big punch from the bottom. He's now working from side control again. Lands a good shot from the bottom. Working from the mounted crucifix. Tries to pass, but can't. Keeping busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Under a minute to go. Oh, elbow to the head. Nice punch to the body. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh, Nasty elbow. elbow lands to the head. Back to the guard position. 30 seconds to go. He lands an elbow here. Well, you gotta be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Oh, he gets reversed and mounted. Tags him with the left. He postures into place. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Horn sounds for the end of round one. Deep breath for me and listen. Okay, let's be tight with our positions. Let's look to get side control, work for that crucifix position. And here we go. Let's take a look at some of this action here. Here we see some high level striking, great accuracy on that punch. Here's a huge slam with perfect technique. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Big round. Brittany Palmer in the building. You ready? You ready? Here we go, early round two. Landed that oh, one. It's oh, it's This could be oh, it. He might be out. Here's a single attempt. Nice takedown. He's looking to pass. And he connects with the punch there. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. He's back to side control. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Big shot from the bottom. Trying to pass here. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Excellent movement here on the ground. Good control here. Busy as he looks to him for a position here. Big punch from the bottom. Nice sweep here, he's got half guard. Oh, pretty good work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom, he's doing it here, nice punch. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Trying to pass here. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Inside control once again. He moves to the mounted crucifix now. This is nasty. 
Landing some good punches from this position. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's looking to take the back. Joe, the hammer fists keep on coming. They're getting blocked here. Into half guard again. And all these shots count. And he's trapped in half guard here. Oh, he got reversed. Oh, look at that. Look at that transition. Posture's up. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Nine seconds to go now. Slides him over and nice reversal here. Hits the reversal here and in the full guard. He got tagged there. Excellent posture here. Let's go. Get him off, you. Get him off. Under a minute to go. And he reverses position. Nice. A little bit of ground and pound. He hip escapes. He's out of the full mouth. Good shot to the body. Posture's up here. Showing some good defense here, trapping that arm. 30 seconds to go in round two. He's back in the full guard now. Good defense here on the ground. He's got that one arm trapped. Strong plot of work here, staying busy. Showing some good defense here on the ground by controlling that arm. He's working for the full round again. Yeah. And the horn sounds on round two. Now, next round, I want you to finish him, okay? He's hurt. I know he's hurt. You know he's hurt. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Amazing highlights from that round. Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste is here. Watch the shot here, Joe. And he lands the hook. Great combination there, Joe. Almost hits him with that left hook. How about that shin? Takedown attempt there. Both stand up. Double underhooks. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here for Bob. Battle for position here. Move 
And now he's got the tie clinch. Works the double underhooks here. And he pummels out of it. They're canceling each other out. Double underhooks in the clinch. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. And they disengage from the clinch. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Try to take the back. Back to side control. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Oh man, that cut is nasty. Tries to pass, but doesn't make it. Oh, big shot. Holding him here, moving to north-south position. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. He, he landed a left hand there. Oh, oh beautiful there. Elbow. Side control again. Big body shot, shot to the body. Trying to spin to the back. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Nice combination of strikes from the full guard. 15 seconds. Well, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Blocked. Big punch from the bottom. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. And here's a nice shot to the body. And here's another beautiful punch to the body. And here's another perfectly placed punch to the body. Good round. That was a good round, but I need those kicks to land a little more. All right? I don't want you to get time. Right? Ariane Celeste in the building. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Absolutely. Good punch. His left eye starting to close up, Joe. Wow. The right and the left behind it. 
just misses with the jab. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Take down here, he gets it. That's a good shot from the bottom. Scramble and go! Scramble and go! Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. He gets the mounted crucifix. Right punches there. Scramble. Caught him with a punch. Big Ooh. elbow. Ground and pound KO. Yeah, Joe, the finish comes courtesy of some outstanding ground and pound. And it's one thing to try to score when you have your opponent in a compromised position on the ground. It's another thing to try to end the fight. And that's exactly what he was trying to do here tonight. Elbows and punches and hammer fists, one weapon after the next. And ultimately, the knockout materializes. Nicely done there. Here it is again from another angle. Check it out here. I mean, just stiff. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. All right, we go inside the octagon now where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta has called a stop to this contest. At one minute, 21 seconds of round number four. The winner by knockout, Hercules. So just the way he drew it up here tonight, what a monumental moment and knockout to get his hand raised here tonight. He kept the judges out of it. He has certainly set himself up for a major opportunity here moving forward. But you can be sure tonight is about this knockout. He'll be celebrating deep into the night with his friends, his family, his coaches. Congratulations on a big KO tonight.